Hello Internet, uh, regular viewers of my channel, hello to both of you, will know that this is a YouTube channel dedicated really to my passion and obsession for horror. Um, but I, I could just as easily uh, have dedicated it to my, to my second and another passion, which, which you won't know about, but which is a, a British weekly comic called 2000 AD which I subscribe to and have been reading religiously for, for probably about 30 years, uh, maybe just a little under that. It's been going since 1977. Uh, it, to my mind, it's the greatest comic that ever existed. Uh, and most famous really for Judge Dredd. The, all of this is a preamble to, to, uh, to a sort of one-off, potentially one-off, but who knows, depends what's inside here, unboxing of uh, a, a Z-Box. Uh, other you 2 regular viewers will know I, I subscribe to Horror Block, the horror theme, uh, uh, again. Uh, but I, for, for £20 I took out uh, uh, just a one-month subscription, not really a subscription, to Zavi's Z box because September's box themed renegades. Uh, each each month it's it's got a theme: good cop, bad cop, uh, undead. Uh, this box is renegades. The particular offer for September's box, for the price of the box, you got uh, a, a free gift. I'll show you the free gift first because this is the reason I purchased the box and I'm doing this unboxing. Um, it came separately, it came early, I've opened it, <laughs> I've, I've, I've ogled over it, uh, and it's a plastic stand. That's right, I got uh, a free plastic stand with this month's uh, set box, and free with this plastic stand, uh, I also got a Judge Dread badge. I am, obviously, Dread is the... Uh, most famous of the dozens, if not up to the uh, uh, past hundreds of characters that have come out of 2000 AD. And this is a replica of Dread's badge from the most recent and amazing Dread 3D. And frankly, what shall I, I'll use the side of my mug. This is, this is no plastic piece of crap. This is a full-scale, proper metal, weighty, solid, movie-accurate replica of Carl Urban's Dread Badge, and it sits on the stand there, and it's a thing of absolute beauty. You can buy it. You can, you can buy this from the Zabby store. I, I didn't know such a thing existed. I found about out about this particular offer on 2000 AD online, on their online community. Someone gave us their the heads up. So frankly, this box cost me 20 quid and I got this with it as well. That box can be full of air and hopes and dreams and I'm already up on a deal. This is beautiful. I coveted this and I now own it. If there's even one good thing in this box, then I'm so far up on the deal, it's unbelievable. I think there's gonna be some Marvel and some DC stuff in there. I think there's an extra 2000 AD item in there as well. Um, I think there's a big, but let's see what's in the Z box. Okay, well, there's there's Deadpool. I think that's meant to be Harley Quinn. Let's just, let's just dive in, shall we? There's your little plushy Deadpool. I'm not the biggest Marvel fan, I'm not the biggest DC fan. I'm all about 2000 AD. I'm all about this weekly British sci-fi anthology. It doesn't mean I can't appreciate things like this. And it certainly doesn't mean that uh, these uh, will not, at a push, make excellent gifts for, for other people. Christmas is a few months around the corner. So there's your plushy Deadpool. Deadpool's gonna become quite a big deal, I think, soon. I, I suspect the, the Ryan Reynolds Deadpool movie is going to be one of the surprise smash hits when that comes out. We've got a we've got a mug, and it is looking to be Harley Quinn. She is 
that particular character is going to blow up in the public consciousness, I think, because of the Suicide Squad movie. I went to London Film and Comic Con this year. There were a ton of Harley Quinn cosplayers. Um, that's a really sort of, that's a quite a nice mug. I mean, I guess if you're into the, into the character, that makes me think of 1940s sort of on the type art work on the side of World War II, fighter planes, Memphis Bell. I'm rambling now. Okay. Uh, a couple of uh, Breaking Bad hand warmers. Uh, Walter White knows a thing or two about handling the heat. Tenuous. <laughs> so I should come as no surprise to learn that he is the perfect partner when it comes to combating the effects of icy conditions. Look, I'm not going to mince any, any words. It's, I think this winter is going to be really cold. These will get used. Um, I've got a blackjack. There's a little blackjack in there. Little sweet from my childhood. Don't know why I've got a blackjack in there. But I'm going to eat that in as soon as I've finished recording this. It's a comic, James Salis's Drive. I've never heard of it. I will read it. Okay, said Box gets its own magazine. I won't read it in front of you now, but what do we also have? Card holder, wallet with two pockets to hold your cards. Uh, and it's got, it's, it's a Captain Cold card holder. I don't know who Captain Cold is. Something to do with the Justice League, perhaps. And finally, there is a two th there is another 2080 item, and it's not a Judge Dread item. And so this, I'm so happy about this. I mean, <laughs> well, if the bo for the box titled Renegade, you can't get much more uh, of a Renegade than uh, 2000 AD's uh, Rogue Trooper. It's it's in his name. This is a uh, this is another uh, series from from 2000 AD. It's a future sci-fi war series. The Rogue Trooper is is a genetic infantryman. He's sort of been cloned to survive the uh, completely toxic and chemically deadly atmosphere of the planet that this particular war uh, between the North and the South is uh, is taking part on. And he was grown, is owned, and fought for. Millicom, that's his side, that's his side's logo until he goes rogue. He's the rogue trooper and Millicom Genetic Infantry Division. Uh, I guess for no one who knows uh, the strip, that doesn't mean anything. But for me, that's, that's a rogue trooper dog tag. I really quite like that. <laughs> and that's it. That, that's the box. Uh, I like that. I, basically, I love both the 2080 items. That I, uh, that's just beautiful. So there you go. Uh, a little, a little video for the Z box, and also just uh, uh, a plug, 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 plug to any of my American viewers who'll be watching this for uh, 2000 AD. If you're sick of the same old, same old. DC, Marvel, constantly rebooting, uh, then check out 2000 AD. If you don't, if you cut, if you have to sort of hunt down the collected editions or the hardbacks or don't want to subscribe to a weekly comic, guess what? You can download them now and probably straight to whatever device you're watching me on here. And if you want something a little darker, a little more satirical, a little more cynical, a little, a lot more gonzo, some of the strips, a lot more out there. Try a little taster of 2018. You won't regret it.